Welcome to How to Have Fun Cruising with Aliche and Tommy T. Today we've got a special video for you. That's right, on the Norwegian Pearl, we take you to Bermuda and show you five secret spots in Bermuda. Not the typical places where they take tourists, places that if you grab a taxi, you're gonna love. So let's check out this video. You're gonna have a great time. As you can see, we arrived in Bermuda all pumped up, ready to go, and ready to have some fun. This is a beautiful island with a lot of great places to visit, and you're gonna love it for sure. I mean, this is one gorgeous island. So don't forget, we've got 20 things to see in Bermuda back on our other channel, How to Have Fun Outdoors. But if you need some more here on how to have fun cruising, we just launched, we survived the Bermuda Triangle, and that is a great video. We show you how we go south of the island. And Whoa, take a all look. the way up here. Take a look at that. Whoa, look at that TV. You can see it got really wild and crazy down in the Bermuda Triangle, but this video is all about the five secret spots, and we're excited to tell you all about it from Bermuda. So we got to some beautiful beaches we're gonna share with you in a minute, but quite honestly, we left Boston, Liche was having a ball, had some great dinner, some jacuzzi, some dancing, and take a look at the evening. It was gorgeous, and the very next morning, guess what? We arrived in Bermuda, and let's check out secret spot number one. Oh. Wow, this is absolutely the best beach ever. Welcome everyone to Bermuda. Bermuda is an amazing island. Tons of beaches, lots of hidden spots, and our goal today is to show you some of those. We got an awesome taxi driver to take us to some of these places, and as you can see as we followed south down, we got to West Whale Bay Park. That's right, the site of the hidden beach, and not too far away, the site of the hidden fort. We'll show you in a minute, and let's go check it out. This is the most intimate beach right here. Wow. How about that, I'll Aliche? One yeah, one of them? <laughs> There'll be people arguing yeah, it, huh? I'm gonna go down there by itself. Yeah. There's... This. Do you see what I'm saying? That's yep. beautiful. Wow. Wow. Intimate scene. Isn't that beautiful? Look, where'd you get? This is a phenomenal beach. I'm gonna go and jump in the water. Let's do it. Let's see what we can do here. Absolutely beautiful out here. Yeah, it's a perfect one. Mm. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, Tommy T. Hey. Welcome to Whale Beach. How about this, Bermuda? Woo! -hoo. Woo -hoo. And then she goes, just like that. <laughs> Oh, it's beautiful. It is way colder than I expected, but he will not stop me. I will jump in. Let's do no it. No matter what. Uh. <laughs> So I was getting ready to go jump into the ocean and the friendly taxi driver nudged me and tried to give me some friendly advice. He said if I did, it would probably hurt the rating. So I decided to stay out and just do some filming. But as you can see here, why go to a beach when you've got thousands of people when you can just go down the road a couple more miles and you can find a secluded beach like this? I say, I, you think I should go in? No, I think the ratings will severely go down. <laughs> <laughs> I agree with you. Absolutely. The ratings will go down. <laughs> Why ruin a good moment? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Overall, Aliche just absolutely loved this beach. What a great place to go. Uh, actually, we ended up having one person, an elderly lady, who I guess swims here quite often, come down to the beach. But overall, it was amazing. So are you ready for secret spot number two? That's right, not too far away actually, but we've got the almighty taxi guide 
and he was able to get us up to this spot through some old trails to an abandoned fort that used to be a park. Check this out. Wow. Kids. Look, Look at this. this. See what I mean? Wow. Hidden fort. <laughs> wow. Pretty awesome, huh, Alicia? Hey, Tommy. Look at the view here. Wow. Well, this was an abandoned fort that used to be actually part of the park and part of the attractions for locals. But it was too much to upkeep and there's so many forts around the island, this one was left alone and nobody is there to take care of it. It's the Whale Bay Battery and you gotta check it out, it's extra. Awesome. Just like secret spot number one, there were no people. And secret spot number two, well, there was a lizard, but no people. What a great place to check out. And the views were stunning of the ocean, but also the trophy golf course that is on the backside of this famous course that we will show you a little bit later. But in any case, the bottom line is, this is a must see. It's a great place to take photos and uh, you know it, it it really does have a great backdrop and it's so secluded and quite honestly it's a neat feeling and it's a pretty cool battery fort if you will lots to see there and you can see all where the guns used to be set up and all the uh, ammunition and overall we were pretty impressed and again a different type of site now, horseshoe bay you, horseshoe they, bay horseshoe they, bay they come off the boat we and, horseshoe bay all right and look at this look what everybody's missing here in bermuda amazing wow look at this this is so cool i wonder what's in here let's Whoa! check it out. hey um, pleased to tell you that the first yeah stores for the ammunition you see all the ammunition was stored in here. This is just one of the storage wow. rooms, storage one. Look at that. Hey, come on, we gotta go. Oh, I love this home. <laughs> Overall, super awesome. We're going to head out of here and get you off to spot number three, but we had to go and take a hidden trail just to get back to the vehicle. Unless you want a souvenir. This is why you got to have somebody with 40 years experience of uh, knowing where the hot spots are. Look at the trails to these places. Yeah, he knows the secret. Yeah. Whoa. Oh, hold your hand. Whoa, there we go. Yeah, we are careful. You need to be careful. We jumped back in the taxi and got a little bit of a tour of Bermuda and some of the great places. But we're going to talk about secret spot number three, the Reefs Resort and Club. This is pretty special. And as our taxi driver highlighted, there's so many of these beautiful resorts right on the water with the little beaches and the great pools, great restaurants. And tourists really don't always get to come to these places unless you're actually staying on the island. But if you do take a taxi and you've got some money, for sure you can come and have dinner, drinks, and hang out. And uh, some of these locations are just phenomenal. Take a look at this. How was it? Pretty cool? Oh, yeah, it was great. All right, let's go check it out. Hey, hey. what's up? Who's that guy in the back there? I don't know. <laughs> He's up. Elis Harbor. This is a must stop for everybody uh, coming to Bermuda. Welcome to paradise. Wow, take a look at that view. Absolutely awesome.
So as you can see, Scour Hill Park is absolutely gorgeous and a really great place to hang out, have a picnic, and just check out the views. So are you ready for secret spot number five? And this one is good. It is the Fort Scour Fort. And I know you're thinking, well, we already seen one fort. But this fort is extra cool. You get to actually walk down inside of it through all these tunnels that are dark. It is like a true exploration and check this out. Wow, a true early Bermuda weatherstone. Go ahead and read it, Liche. Oh yeah, it's so magic. This stone is the perfect weather indicator. A dry stone means it is not raining. Wow. A wet stone means it is raining. A shadow under the stone means that the sun is shining. If the stone is swinging, it means there is a strong wind blowing. If the stone jumps up and down, it means there is an earthquake. If ever it is white on top, believe it or not, it is no way. All right. Help me out here. <laughs> wow. Look at how far down this goes. This is crazy. I need more. Wow. This is definitely a must see. Uh, we're down here. Every kid would go crazy for this. Remember these more. Wow. <laughs> more. What? Keep going. This is wild. Look at this. Look at this. That's it? Yeah. Wow, it dead ends. Yeah. Look at this. Super duper close. This is cool, isn't it? Yeah. Wow. Must see. Hi, what? Buddy. He I'm took our money. The taxi guy. There. The taxi guy Dad, took I'm our a money. Good girl. I'm not bad. Don't punish me. Look at this. This is a classic taxi. Oh, Tommy. These taxis take your money and then they trap you Dad, in. Run away. <laughs> <I'm not busy. laughs> hey, we got out of there. We want our money back. Come we, on. We gave him a pardon. We uh, gave him a pardon. Hey. I'm a good girl. Ah, uh, you better straighten out and then I'll let you out. What? Yeah, come on. I no, I don't think so. You don't think so? <laughs> well, we hope you enjoyed this video. So many cool things to see and do on Bermuda, but these are five little secret spots that not a lot of tourists go to. We hope you enjoyed this video a lot. 
it's super, super great place to visit, and uh, this will be on your list next time you go. So thank you for watching How to Have Fun Cruising, and definitely subscribe, hit that like button, and thank you so much for watching How to Have Fun Cruising.